Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name's Tom from Master Code on Online, and today I'm going to introduce you to our new Django Pro tutorial series. All right. Um, I know I was in the middle of doing a tutorial series on Django, and I've had a lot of questions asked through the comments on YouTube, and I know some people are getting really confused. So I failed to uh, explain why I was coding some things in a certain way and you guys shouldn't have questions after you're done watching one of my tutorials and that's how I feel so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start this tutorial series over and what we're gonna do is we're gonna build a template for Django and it's gonna be your starting template uh, it's gonna be configured to for your development process and your production process and what I mean by your production process it's gonna be set up so all you have to do is simply put a couple lines of code into your um, terminal and send this site off to Heroku and it would be hosted. All right, that is my goal in setting up a template. All right, then I'm going to teach you how to set it up in Heroku and then from there I'll teach you guys how to build apps. But the main goal here at first is to make sure we can get um, not only Django set up properly. Because Django does come set up pretty much for us, but there's a little tweaking that you always have to do. And if we can set up a template where you guys don't have to do that tweaking every time, it'll make your life so much easier. And that tweaking usually has to do with how we're going to set up our site in production. So what I'm going to do is teach you how to show you how to make a template that you can just constantly use over and over again. And you guys only have to worry about writing some code to bring websites to life. All right, so that's my goal. Um, and that's why I kind of stepped away from the previous tutorial series because that one I was shooting from my hip and I feel like uh, I wasn't getting um, my knowledge out there enough. So what I'm going to do is take it a little bit slower and show you how to properly do it because I have a template that I use all the time. And when a client calls me, bang, I throw up that um, template, take what they want, build the site up on the server, and see you. And that's how it should be. All right. So if you guys have any questions, please let me know. Otherwise, keep moving on through the tutorial series. You guys are going to learn a lot. I promise you that. And uh, 